So, we ready to go, gentlemen? Yeah! All right, sweet. So, ladies and gentlemen and people of ages, I can't speak English, but welcome to the Forbidden Juice. This is AD. This is Coach Tang. <laughs> Pope, what are you doing, I, man? I, 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 have, I have totally forgotten. <laughs> I haven't been around for a while. I wasn't sure if it was going to be true function of my government name, but we're going to be government name. I'm an older man, so it's Toppy. Oh, is it? You actually yeah, get a yeah, government yeah. on this? Nah, fuck that. True, true function of the name. Ah, all day. There we go. All day. But yo, people, <laughs> this is the Forbidden Juice where we spill the juice on all things forbidden. Do you dare take a sip? Yes, yes sir. sir. All right. Hey, so, I remember. There we go. I told, I told you. I told you. So, I <laughs> Bro, oh man, it's been a long time. Today, we're just taking it easy with this topic. We're just chilling. Well, we say we're taking it easy, but it is going to be a topic that is near and dear to our hearts. And that is going to be, what is the greatest video game console of all time? I'm going to chuck my hat in the ring straight off rip. Oh, I'm not. Okay, no, I'm torn between two. You're I'm torn between. Dumb, like Famicom or something, isn't it? What? Oh, no, say no, no, right here. <laughs> no, no. What? No. <laughs> Mm, no, I, I appreciate what it did for history, but no. I'm thinking either Xbox 360 or PS2. PS2 for the win. That's me. That's what? my gauntlet straight down. And you know Nothing what? else, it can all suck a dick. <laughs> PS2. PS2. So how many of you guys here have going for N64? You, no way are you Actually, oh, no, 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 no. No way. Yes. Do you know what? Wait, yes. Wait, do you know what? Yes. yes. I, you don't believe that. I, yes. N64. As yes. the greatest console of all time. Yes. Can I say something? What? Whatever you I, say is going to be wrong. I don't, I don't disagree with him. <laughs> what? I, I, wait, wait, wait. I, wait, wait. I disagree with him is what I meant yeah. to say. PS2 for the win. But our, for the sheer content of like nostalgic games on the N64. Come on, bro. Okay. Super Mario 64. Smash. Okay. Golden Eye. But, okay, 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 look, I have never, okay, I'll, I'll say this, I'll say this, I never you had an N64. About that. I never <laughs> had an N64. Wait, 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 first of, wait, two things, first off, you forgot Ocarina of Time. So, oh, yeah, I was going to mention that next, next. Yeah, come on, second now. of all, so we, even you, you are real, real, but this is, wait, 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 and then there's Majora's Mask, Majora's Mask, okay, wait, wait, which is less, less, less so, but still, but all right, all right, but this is the thing, right, so I never had an N64, so, We've got to. Oh, so we should suffer. So this is, oh, yeah, wait, yeah. wait, 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 wait. Your wait. lack of video games. Wait, hold on. We have to suffer. Wait, hold no. on. Hold on. I said fucking hold on, man. So, N sixty four, right? I appreciate of how good a console it was, how great it was, whatever, whatever. But like, bro, let's not act like PS two wasn't coming with the slappers as well, bro. One hundred. Yeah. But that's why I, mean, I disagree with him. But I can see why he would throw it in the ring. Okay, wait, it's a you, close wait, one. Do you see why I threw Xbox three hundred and sixty in the ring? No. What? No. The, the 360 was... Bro. Ma- okay, bro. First off, first listen, off, first listen. off, wait, wait, wait. All right, wait, wait. So Xbox 360, right? First off, we're talking about the Xbox Live. Xbox Live versus P- um, PlayStation, whatever they called it at the time. Xbox Live was winning them times. So there was that, right? And they had Xbox um, Games for Gold as well at the time. Revolutionary, right? Then if we're talking about the just the generation of console, obviously... It wasn't exclusive to Xbox, but we're talking like Grand Theft Auto 4, for example. We've got Halo, like Halo 3, I think it was, that then came out on the Xbox 360, which was big. It, yeah, yeah. There were the Gears games, yeah, which were really massive did. at the time. Yeah, yeah. Like, And then the controller itself, to this day, people are still using either that controller or a variation of that controller. So it had one of the greatest just, just, controllers just, just the time. Though, the Xbox controller was based off the PlayStation controller. No, but it was better. It's better. No, no. Yes. It was be- it was better for shooting games. Yeah. Fighting games, Xbox was trash. What? And the PlayStation is much better. Way better. Wait, wait. Which PlayStation? Way wait, which PlayStation? better. Hold on, hold on, hold on. PlayStation, hold on, hold on, hold on. PlayStation 2, 3, two all the terrible. PlayStation games. Whoa, 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 whoa. Two, two if you terrible. guys ain't playing fighting games with a joypad, what the fuck are you guys doing? You, no, 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 you can, you can get, get out of here. No, I, no, 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 wait, 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 no, wait, no, wait, these no, mans are playing with money pop sticks, man. Get the fuck out of No, 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 Fight pad is is hard. The fight it, pad is hard. It is hard. Exactly. Thank you. Thank it you. is hard. But I'm Thank saying, you. your average gamer, your your person who didn't go into the whole gate, the fighting okay. community, better pad was definitely PlayStation. Bro, pad. I have to disagree. PlayStation I have to pad. disagree, bro. I fight, have to disagree. Shooting games, bro, I give Xbox all no, the money. I have to disagree, fam. Do you know what's the one thing that was horrible on 
basically every single PlayStation console, bro. The sticks, the sticks have always what, been bad. analog. Analog. You man are using bad. analog. That's your problem, bro. Who told you the D pad no, is always the thing, bro? The D pad is always the thing, bro. Bro, let's let's fast forward to now. Uh huh. Twenty twenty three. I have an Xbox Series S. Uh -huh. I'm playing Guilty Gear Strive. It is disgusting. Give me a PS pad or even better, Nintendo Switch Pro. Mwah! Wait, have you, I just, out of curiosity, have you held the Xbox Elite controller? Because the Elite controller 2, fantastic. Bro. Okay, so I don't have the money for that right now. It's bro. pending soon. Bro, bro. <laughs> bro, 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 bro I'm, I'm, I'm going to so. get it. I'm going to get it. Okay. But my brother got it already. Okay. And I've already got the PlayStation Pro controller all as right, well, right. the DualSense Edge. You know, so I'm when I held, but this is the thing, this is the thing, the DualSense wait, wait, Edge, the DualSense Edge before, is fantastic, okay. but you see before the I Xbox. Let you run, before I let you run, before I let you run, let's, let's set some parameters, okay? Uh -huh. For us to say the greatest console, I think what you get out of the box, because when you start adding extra features, fair enough, but out of the box, mm -hmm. PlayStation 2 straight away smashes. I still think the Xbox 360. No, do you know one of the, I think the out Xbox of the box, no. out of the box. First and foremost, the Xbox. Nah, wait, hold on, no, 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 wait, no. Out, wait. out of the box. No, no. PlayStation takes an overall. Wait, PlayStation, wait, wait. Yeah. PlayStation Two, Two takes over. Out the of the box. Wait, 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 wait. In terms of the games you get, the controls, no extra stuff. We're not talking about elite stuff or these like you know what they call it, Wildcats control pads, all of those extra stuff. We're just oh talking about God, the standards. <laughs> well, my man hit that turbo button right there. That <laughs> turbo button. Say, no no so one knew how to use that turbo button. Listen, I figured that Bro, thing out. Once I turned that, once I figured that, once I figured that shit out. My God, it was game, game, game over. over. First what person is, game, time game over. Time, time splitters. Bro, time my man turned my, my handgun into a fully automatic. <laughs> Literally, Bro, time splitters you know too. Time splitters. I've never played hey, them type games, so that's, that's... There we go. And that's there on you, go. bro. That's on you. We need something for your ignorance, I bro. Could, I could give you the most crazy... Because I had an Xbox 360. I couldn't get the PS3 and I had an Xbox 360. Mm. And I had that for six months. I enjoyed some games, but they were like the big titles exclusive, Xbox exclusive titles. But beyond that, their games didn't interest me anymore because they were available on all platforms. Whereas okay. PlayStation had the exclusives that just slapped... Art. And that PS2 control pad was durable. Did you not go to your brethren's house where he peeled no! off, where he peeled off that thing on the analog stick, but you can still use the analog stick? Oh, uh, and I have another thing for I'm you. Lie, the amount of times I've dashed my PlayStation pad into the wall, and it still was sturdy. Number two. <sighs> now another thing I will say about the Xbox 360 was the most baitest thing that came out: the Red Ring of Death. Can we talk about the Red Ring of Death? Because the PlayStation 2 did not have that issue. <laughs> Oh, and my mum dashed my PlayStation <laughs> 2 and the expansion bay came out. I was like, oh lord, she's broken it. Plugged the thing in, it went shoo. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, <laughs> still working. Oh, Ooh, bro. perfect. Bro. And also, oh. also, yeah. dumb, also, one other thing about the Xbox 360 <laughs> batteries. Yes, batteries. battery controller. You needed to put oh, two right. AA batteries in the back of it. Bro. Do you know what's jarring? And you still do you know, it. Are you still wait, saying wait, it? Wait, do you know what's jarring? Wait, do you know what's jarring? Do you see your face? Do you know what's jarring? Face? Wait, 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 wait. Do you know what's jarring on the Xbox? If you drop that controller, the battery pack pop out. <laughs> so you're like, oh shit. Done. <laughs> done. 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 Especially done. if you're playing a game that doesn't pause when the batteries come out. So the yeah. game is still running. Yeah. And you're like, yo shit. I was yeah. to take your pad, put the Bro. batteries back in and, oh the no. The amount of times tough. I played Street Fighter 4, because I got Street Fighter 4 and that was like when I first played it on Xbox 360. When those batteries popped out, Man was getting destroyed online. <sighs> getting destroyed. So oh. PS2, I would say second would be Nintendo 64. You'd put the 360s on top 360. five. In fact, we're talking about outside the box, like come out of the out box. Out the box, man. Yeah. Uh, it's a great, do you know what it is? The live features and stuff was amazing, but at the time- You need to pay for that shit. That's the thing. You barely that was anything. The thing. But, but, PSN, even though uh, it was shit, it was, it was, shit. It was, it was shit. free. Yeah, and that was this big selling point for the PS3 back then. But, though. but no, 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 and yeah. and, the, and the Blu-ray DVD. Ah, ah, no, 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 no. To be fair, I think I think the Blu-ray is what killed the PS3 and why. Yeah, 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 yeah for sure. Because so at, the, that cause at the time, pricey. no, because at the time, basically, it was literally a case of, you know, when we start. This is when we start that time when we started having, uh, what you call it, like tech wars. Samsung versus iPhone, yeah, 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 PC yeah. versus Mac. It, it started off with PS mostly, yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so then it was literally Blu-ray over HDD, and it was 
that was the fight. So peak consumers were like, oh, do I want to invest in Blu-ray or mm. do I want to invest in um, high density drives? And Blu-ray is not really all and that nowadays. Exactly. exactly. So people were like, you know what, Blu-ray, we don't see it taking off, or we're gonna get the disc drive. Yeah. So we're all gonna we're all gonna sleep lean more towards the Xbox. Mm. I, so I won't lie to you. I'm that was a big that was a big part of it. And now if we flash forward to now. Xbox is smashing it. Like no, no, no. Like, literally, Xbox the only smashing. things that have Blu-ray drive is literally your PlayStation consoles. Like who That's has it. a Blu-ray player? Does the uh, Xbox Series X have one? Nope. Oh yeah, yeah. It does. It does. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah. yeah, yeah. got. Yeah, yeah. Don't disrespect my Xbox Series X like that. <laughs> <laughs> but I don't know about my point now. So now, like, but normal CD drives. Well, for the for the places that do still use CDs, yeah, still yeah. use a CD drive. Don't use a Blu-ray drive. True. Mm. Like, very yeah, true, Blu-ray yeah. is very. I've it's never, never Blu-ray, Blu-ray is very very niche. I've never owned a single Blu-ray disc. And even if you did own a Blu-ray, if you don't have the the TV for the sound yeah. system, mm-hmm. exactly. It, just you might just, just, just watch it on the like just, normal just stream it because we've mm. got streaming services. Now. I mean, right. nowadays, laptop, like, like most devices don't even come with a disc drive no more. Right. Yeah. Quick question, true. quick question. Do you guys for <clears> for Xbox 360 versus PS3? Do you think? PS3 won that generation or Xbox no. 360. Xbox won it. No, but this is the thing. PS3 I think PS3. Up. No, PS3. PS3 won it overall in the long run. Long, yeah. long run. Yeah. In the long, in the long, long run. Won. Because immediately what happened is their price point was off. Yeah. It was ridiculously expensive. It was this Blu-ray, Blu-ray player. But at the same time, it was backwards compatible. But this is my issue with the current generation of stuff. Is that backwards compatible? Oh no 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 no! So I know you I know you say that, but yeah. literally they've done like both. I was like Microsoft and Sony have done like the consumer testing and surveys and all that crap. So basically, the percentage of people that actually want backwards compatibility. Oh, the older generation. And it's, a it's, is, it's no no no. Is a sure. is obviously the older generation, but mm. secondly, the percentage of people who wanted it mm-hmm. in terms of the survey, mm-hmm. I think it came up to like thirty five percent of the people that they surveyed. Okay. And then of. The consumer base that actually have the console mm-hmm. when they've gone through all the, inf- the the data collection stuff of mm-hmm. people who actually played the old, games. old retro games, mm-hmm. it worked out to something be like 0.6%. Oh, yeah. really? That, that, that so then they would so, uh, really. so then Fair they enough. just went, you know what, there's no point offering if a lot of people are saying it, they're not using it. Yeah, so yeah, what's the true. point? So numbers game. Like, because yeah. if you think about it as well, right? Like the only back as the the majority of people are only going back like a generation. Yeah. And by that, I mean like if you've got a PS5 right now, you're playing like <clears throat> PS4 and PS5 games. Going past PS4, that's like a small bucket of people in it. I'm not going to lie. If they put no, if they put like the PS2 bangers on there, like literally everybody would. All right. Uh, do, do you know what? No. Literally, you know what? all I'm waiting Hold for on it. PlayStation is that Need for Speed Underground 2. Don't get twisted. I am banging that shit on the game. Hold on. I'm involved. I've just changed my mind about what the greatest console is. And what, it what do you think it is? Off. What are you going to say? It's not specifically a console, but because of everything you're saying, this is just my personal opinion. Actually, no, I'll put it as number two because PS2 still sucks. <laughs> yeah, but wait, wait, Steam wait. Deck. Oh, you're. Oh, no, 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 no. Don't hate. Yes, don't hate. I'm, I'm, let, me, let me digest this one. Yeah, yeah. Digest let me, it. Let me digest, digest Steam Deck. It. Di- digest it. Digest Out it. of all the consoles we've ever had, and you think the Steam Deck is the second best one that we've ever had? I think. Do you know why I say that? Okay, wait, sorry, second. I can, see, I can see why. Yes. Wait, 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 wait. I can see wait, why. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Let me just put, ch- chuck this out here for. Explanation because this is the thing we never actually define what we mean with the question. So when we're saying greatest, what are we saying? Because okay, all right. Do you know what? Let's let's do categories. Let's do uh-huh. categories. Let's make it let, break it down a little bit more. Best games roster. That should be one, and then we can all say what we want. Ooh, this is and then best one out of the box and best innovation. Okay, okay, but the, 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 okay. Because okay, okay. like then there's like three that. of those. Those, like those three yeah, categories yeah, 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 gives like you a that. lot like of that. room to I work like that with. A lot. Okay. So c- roster wise, PlayStation Two. Cannot be beaten. The games, even to this day, that I've been finding on YouTube that goes by, they're like, I want to play that game. I didn't even know that existed. Couldn't you theoretically say that the Steam Deck could yeah, be that because it could just emulate all the games? No, no, but that's an emulation. Do you oh, know okay. what I'm saying? So you're saying in original. terms of what was programmed and developed. Okay, okay, because okay. Because okay, the Steam okay, Deck okay. in itself, that's what I'm saying. I'm like, mm, I can't no, really put it there because it's in the center PC. Like quite a lot, because quite a lot of the. I guess quite a lot of the older games mm-hmm. is available on Steam Deck. But or by, that's like, talking by about the... availability and backwards compatibility and what works. But at the time, a lot of these games are not developed specifically for the Steam Deck. That. They were made for a console that happens to... We're, we're at a point where the tech is able to emulate older games. That doesn't mean it was necessarily created for the Steam Deck. For okay, example, so, so, for, so, no, so, for argument, so for the topic, it's... The game itself has to be designed and for, for that console. It was designed for that. Okay. For that okay. Do you see okay. Exactly. Nice. Roster wise, yes. I think so the so then, What about cross platform games then? Cross platform games, but they're only far and few between. Do you see what I'm saying? No, like I'm saying, like so you got like 
Grand Theft Auto, Call of Duty. So those games aren't specifically designed for PlayStation or Xbox. Yes, I mean, it is. Yes. Actually, we can we can move those. So out and are we still are we just saying too. like obviously Metal Gear Solid, uh, Gears of War, yeah. Halo Three? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So just Kingdom Hearts. Yeah, so it's like literally just specific. Th- those those specific franchises. Exclusives. Yeah, that were made for those. And I still feel like the PlayStation 2, when you go into it, fucking hell. There's one game that, if you guys don't know about this game, it's still one of my best games I've ever played when I came across it. It's Katamari Damacy. If you do not know about that game, oh my lord. That is a good indication of the kind of development that PlayStation 2 was receiving. Onomusha, f- fucking Def Jam series before they ruined it with Icon and made it all <laughs> cross platform. And, and since then, it hasn't come back alive. Def Jam Fight Night. Def Jam Fight for Fight for NY. I've emulated that on my Steam Deck and I have enjoyed playing that with all the full juice right. and nostalgia. The more I think about the PS2 libraries and the games Do you get what I'm saying? Them, like, like some of my favorite games of all time came from, from PS2. Play, yeah. PS2. You know I mean? I'm thinking obviously like GTA San Andreas is one of them. San Andreas. Um, Devil May Cry. Devil May Soul Cry. Soul Calibur 2 is what I really love from there as well. Yeah. Didn't they do Soul no. Blade on there? No, that was on no, the PlayStation 1. They, but they, they, yeah. well, it was cross-platform, these, a few of these games I'm talking yeah, yeah, about. Yeah. But even then. But I think um, it was much later before it became a cross-platform thing. I think. No, 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 Soul, Soul, Calibur, Soul, Calibur, Soul, Calibur, Soul Calibur came out. It came out on the Dreamcast, first of all. Yeah. And then it was on Dreamcast. Yeah, and then it was on like the. I game... know, I know, but the Dreamcast. <laughs> I know. Was, like... was on the GameCube. Yeah, it, like Soul Calibur was on like the GameCube, Xbox, and PlayStation Two. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Are you sure that it. wasn't three or four? I know no, three no. definitely was. Three I definitely think was. Two might have been. I think two might. I think two. Have been. I think two was. I think two was cross. I'm platform. pretty sure two was cross plat. But um, even then, like the like, bro, even like games like True Crime, Streets of LA. Oh my, oh my god, god, brother! Oh my <laughs> god. <laughs> Fire. I just remember one point. Need for Need for Speed. Day that was fire. the last cross platform. It but number two was. Was no, that no, no, cross platform? Both for cross platform. Both for cross platform. Oh wait, was Simpsons hit and run? Yes, um, yes, platform. it was. Yeah, was it was. Yeah, cross platform. Yeah. Oh, shit, okay. cross flat. Cross platform. Okay, because but even then, Simpsons hit and run was old. But everyone, this is the thing though. What what happened with the PlayStation Two is despite its because I actually watched a little YouTube sort of clip on it is that the amount of units it started selling over time. Yeah, crazy. And the amount of people that had a PS2. Crazy. Madness. I think think they only stopped selling, like manufacturing or or selling games for the PS2 in like 2019. Yeah. It was recent. It was it, yeah. Which means it it was still had a market, especially in Japan. Bro, stop. No, because of the reason. No, 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 no. no. So the reason, okay. So the the big reason for PlayStation 2's, um, like obviously ongoing sales in Japan is quite a lot of the games that aren't available in the in Europe, US, mm-hmm. aren't uh, which are available in Japan, are aren't moved on to the later generations. Okay. So if we take so so if we take for instance like the Monster Hunter series, yeah, yeah, there are a couple of uh, I mean Monster Hunter. There's a couple. There's a couple of games which didn't get ported over to PS3 and PS4, PS5. Mm. So you literally had to have a PS2 to play. And them. then yeah, obviously yeah, yeah, yeah. people who play Monster Hunter games, these guys are very very clicky in their very so they play. So they pick up. So obviously, if they pick like all the new, like the newer kids, like I guess the kids now, they pick up Monster Hunter. They play Monster Hunter League World, uh, Rise, Rise, Sunbreak. Yeah. They're like, ah, oh, this is banging. And then obviously, all the old heads are like, yo, you gotta play the old ones. <laughs> old <laughs> what ones. you know, man? And then the old ones are just like, yo, you gotta try this one out, try that one out. And then they try, and they're like, and they're like this is clunky. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, but in order for them to try it, they need to go back. And yeah, do it. yeah, I get you. But I then, to be fair, even like. Like even now, so Monster Hunter World and Sunbreak and Rise, mm. they've only mod- like modernized the, I guess, the gameplay because mm. they've opened it up to Western and European audiences mm. who can't deal with the clunkiness. In Japan, it's Monster Hunter isn't known for its fluidity. It's known for its, I should say, its content depth and and tech. It's, it's and a techie tech, game. It's a techie game, mm. so you have gotta learn like specific combos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And each cap, like each weapon, only has like three combos. So it's like you gotta learn the combos like traps, bombs, and you gotta like actually plan this shit out. So it's more techy than just go with the flow combos. So like if you take for instance like you take Tekken, and you do your combos, it's kind of it blows and it actually feels quite nice when you hit those combos. Yeah, 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 you're right. You're Monster right. Hunter, it doesn't feel nice when you no, hit no, them, no, but you've just gotta. You'd be swinging like this. 
Yeah, <laughs> and, the, and the dragon's already like licked you like a yeah, couple yeah, of times. times. He's like, ah, oh, fuck's sake. Yeah. All right, so. But you've just reminded me of another game speaking of Japan Zone of Enders. Mm hmm. Bango. Mm. Zone of Enders. Bango. This also. I've got to make another character because of this. All right, go on. The game's rosters, especially because what the PS2, and I, I feel like they've fallen away from their I, their sort of ethos, is that because they were sort of Japan-centered, mm -hmm. and a lot of the developers were Japanese, and they were given the sort of creativity to go crazy, mm -hmm. not only were the games just interesting to play, yes. but the OSTs, Bandy. some of the soundtracks for all of those games slapped mm -hmm. so hard yep. not to mention that for a very long time even though it was a cross-platform game at some point final fantasy was home i was gonna say final fantasy oh, the bro? square enix games was just home with sony yep. Yep. yeah i mean to this day they still kind of are a bit. But i'm not gonna lie they fell off with uh what you call it uh, avengers. Avengers. <laughs> oh oh my <laughs> lord oh my avengers. lord oh my lord we're not talking about that one avengers. we ain't talking about that Square Enix made an Avengers Oh, you game. mean the Marvel Avengers? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. That game, yeah, that's true. Square Enix, you done fucked up. You done fucked up on that one. Okay, so, all right. Okay, this is one more game I'm going to just throw out there as, like, fond memories. Although there's plenty I could. Actually, no, I'm going to just mention a few games. Yeah, yeah. Um, You know, so Metal Gear, the Metal Gear of games. Of course, oh, yeah. Obviously. Sons of Liberty yeah, was my first one. But yeah, oh, then I went back to it. Then, um, Have you seen something like these foolish ways to kill people like, on YouTube and shit? <laughs> no. <laughs> you should, literally, after this, go on YouTube, just type in like funny ways on Metal Gear Solid Kills. <laughs> like, literally, I'm sure there's going to be some yeah, sick stuff. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah, Metal yeah. Gear, there's God of War franchise as well. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Before so God we of got War the started yeah, on yeah, PS2. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Still somewhat an exclusive as well. Yeah. The Resi Evil games. Oh my god, yeah. You know what I mean? And I'm pretty sure those were exclusive to Yeah, the yeah, they, yeah they, they were before they became Because so, they were Japan only. Yeah. yeah. And they were like, fuck Microsoft! I know. So, <laughs> so no. And, but, but the game that I have just very fond memories of, Dragon Ball Z games, bro. Especially Budokai. No, but Budokai was cross. No, no, no. It was late. That was after. I came after. What, Tenkaichi? Yeah. No, 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 no
Mike, how do we feel about freaking Toby? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> it's Toby in it. That's the Toby. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's the Spider Toby Spider-Man. But, Toby Spider-Man too. But, but also Ultimate Spider-Man, the shell sated one. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you get yeah, to play yeah, as Venom. Yeah, that yeah, game yeah. was slept on. Mm. And another game that just come to mind because I could just list them off. Tenchi. Yeah. Tenchi yeah. Muyo. I've just oh, the ninja yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. I've just remembered another one. I've just remembered another one. Burnout. Oh, the but then that was that cross. Then that no, yeah, that was cross. I think that was. I think that was. Well, cross, on PS from PS2 days. Yeah, yeah, yeah I think it was on Xbox. Yeah, it was. Is it? I thought yeah, it was yeah, on Dreamcast yeah. as well. Was it? No, 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 no. It wasn't Dreamcast. It wasn't Dreamcast. Ah, uh, no, I don't know. Is it? No, Wait, no, no. Oh, it would have oh, been no. on Dreamcast because Burnout was a US. <laughs> I just ah, remember. Okay. I just remember. I don't know if this was cross platform or not, and I'm not saying it's a good game, but like Shadow the Hedgehog. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that, that existed. Yeah. Like, <laughs> that came after the yeah, whole Sonic Adventure yeah. too, and it was like so, no, 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 Sonic no, no, Heroes. Sonic, Sonic Heroes. Sonic Heroes. Heroes. Sonic Heroes. Sonic Heroes. Sonic Heroes. That was cross platform. That was cross platform. That was crap, but I still a bang on. That game was kind of shit. I enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah, I enjoyed it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a bang. I enjoyed it. How can you call it shit if you enjoy it? No, because you have shit. No, yeah, you can have shit games you enjoy. Like here's here's one game that I had on PS2 that was shit, but I enjoyed the hell out of it. It's called Godai. Like it was one elemental. Um, game it's Godai G O D A I, and like it was one elemental game, but it's pants. But I loved it. I don't know why. <laughs> I just loved it. Oh, how could we never speak about it? I never played it, but Okami. Oh yeah, oh, with the the wall yeah. as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I never played it, but yeah, I've heard I never really it, good but... things. Bro, yeah, Dark they Cloud. Least, they did really Dark Cloud. Dark yeah, Cloud. Yeah. They emulated that, and then yeah. Dark Chronicles. Fam, hold up a second. How have we talked about we? Okay, I think we've agreed that PS2 library. But like, let's not act as if, bro. <laughs> The PS2 also had backwards compatibility, so to be able to play yeah, all your PS1 games. So when you were able After to box. bang out Tekken 3 on your PS2, bro, bro. We, we, all know the, we all know this room. No eyes, no ears, no mouth, no, <laughs> mouth, no body, no form. There's Tekken tag, bro. Hey, I just remembered. Remember the eye toy on the PS2? Yeah! The eye toy was, was good! That was before the Switch came out. Yeah. I mean, yeah, the yeah, Wii, the Wii, yeah, yeah, Wii. Yeah. yeah, before that, before that, because they were the first one to yeah. do that. Yeah, bro. See, yeah. no PS2. But, but but that doesn't that doesn't count only because out of the it's box, it's not out of the box. Yeah, it's yeah, an yeah. addition. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, but yeah. I'm just no, that but out of the box is it. the second category. So we're talking about the games catalog first. Yeah, 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 yeah. Games. PS2, right? Like I, I I'm struggling to think of a of a game catalog or even generation that was more. Mm, than two. I would say the only thing that might be able to rival <clears throat> that generation would probably have to be like PS3, Xbox 360 era. Probably. And I'm thinking of stuff yeah. like Uncharted coming out. Yeah. Um, what, are we talking roster games or just out the box? Because roster's still PS2. Yeah. In mm. terms of its, its sheer collection. Yeah, if you look yeah. at the collection yeah, side. Yeah, it's crazy. The only thing that even comes nowhere, anywhere near it is the GBA. In terms of the games you could play on GBA, GBA had an extensive collection. I want to say DS. Mm. Nah, Game Boy Advance. It, Game it, Boy Advance is a bigger library. It has a yes. massive, a it? massive library, okay. yeah. a massive library. So basically, okay. the, the reason being that is because with the with the like the NDS is because they got the track the trackpad. Yeah, yeah. So they want to do the program, the game, the program, the features for the trackpad as well, which just takes development into a whole. Yeah, but yeah. I will say. Um, just off of creativity, I genuinely think that the DS and the Wii hold best creativity. Nintendo, innovation. Just innovation. Nintendo, Nintendo holds just, it. Just, just Nintendo holds it. Just look at the controllers. Just go, just, yeah, yeah. Go, just go through time into the controllers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 They start Nintendo, with the square. Nintendo, but what would, around at the edges. But what would, it, what would it be though? Which console specifically? Then? What? That's the best Nintendo innovation. Console? Innovation. Uh, innovation. It's got to be, be the Wii. It's got to be the Wii. It has to be the Wii. I might argue Switch. Nah. nah. So, I, so I t- okay. I, I guess I can see why. Yeah, I can see why, but I love the Wii. Actually, no. You know, I agree with you. It's the Wii. I agree with you. Yeah. Do you know why? Because innovation-wise, they innovated backwards with the <laughs> fucking how their games are buggy, the way they look. I'm like, the Wii games look better. Yeah. How? How? Yeah. Like Wii's. Yeah, we are. The give Wii it to was there. Like, the Wii was the first. Was the first console to do like. Motion, motion yeah. controls to a T, and not, yes, yeah. So the eye toy did do it, but I remember playing the eye toy and playing yeah, the but that wasn't, game that but, wasn't great. But the, yeah. I, but the, the guess is the eye toy thing was it's more camera. Mm. So it that's, was, true. Yeah, that's, it's, true. that's true. That's true. That's true. That's true. Yeah. yeah. Where, where, where this is it. motion control. Motion control. Yeah. And, the, and the way they made games slap with it, I remember yes. playing Super Mario Galaxy with it. One thing, one thing I hate about the Wii playing first person shooting the games. Oh my god. Oh yeah. I wanted to puke my guts out. Hold up a second now. Hold up now. 
Okay. Uh, no, okay. No, 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 no. Out of the box. No, no, wait, wait, no, wait, no, no, no. What I was going to say is first person shooters, fine. But rail shooters banged with that. So I played Ghost Squad on the Wii. That game there is so cold when you're playing it with the Wii. Because, so you know like Time Crisis and shit yeah, like yeah, that? Yeah, yeah. It's basically that. Uh, and doing that with the Wii controller, I'm telling nah, you, bro, so the, only reason, so no, the only reason, the only reason I, I say that makes me, yeah. it's just literally, because you're doing this with your arm and you're obviously using the non-truck. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I and can like, imagine I know it's, the, it's, it's the way the camera pans. I can imagine. It's what it's gives you like that. So is yeah. that more yeah. development than the actual Wii itself? That probably yeah, 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 yeah. So, but no, like I just said, like it's the development because like the same happened like when I played Call of Duty on it. Like the same with well, the way it pans. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. so it just, it was just, it's one. just, it's just, it's just. I think it's just the way first-person shooters, the way they just interacted with the console itself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's it what made me just want to. Yeah, like, yeah. I, I can imagine that that would be ugly as hell. But you, but I. But okay. to be fair, if we're talking about first-person shooters, real still. I never played that. So basically, you basically the story behind it is is like uh, I know the game. I just never played it. Yeah, Isn't that the, the, the boxing one with the robots? No, no, no. no, no, no. no. So Real basically, it's a first person one. shooter game, and you got basically you got a sword as well. Mm. So you shoot people, then you press B, switch, whooshing, and yeah, you can and see then the. Yeah, you can be like a sword. I might have to try that game. No, but, <laughs> shall I tell you what though? Yeah, the Wii was also heartbreaking when most controls didn't work well. In the oh yeah, because bro, I remember when you tried to calibrate the thing because it weren't working properly. Lost it, <laughs> and then, then some games just couldn't do it well. So for example, I had a Bleach game on the oh uh, yeah yeah yeah. Bro, you that required no skill. You just went like this, and your guy went. Like, <laughs> you activate your bankai, and it was dead. And it was horrible. <laughs> oh, right. It days. came up with the thing was bankai, and then just like there's no, there's no, there's no. Uh, there's no, there's no, to there's no but on the flip side, though, I'm not. The, the thing is though, some games work hard on the Wii as well. Like um, there was a Naruto game. Uh, what was it called? Battle Revolution or something like that? Or remember. Ninja Revolution, I think it was called. Bro, on the Wii, it was gold, bro. Like, I enjoyed the fuck out of that game on Wii. Mm. And here's another game that was sick on the Wii, and I feel like it was underrated, fam. Trauma Center. Nah, bro. bro My man wanted, wants to play freaking Operation on the freaking Wii. Bro, it was so sick. I, don't, I didn't have any of those games. I wasn't All right, so, no, fam. I but, hacked my Wii to get it, bro. But you think I bought that? No. No, I'm not gonna lie. I thought like I've still got my Wii. I still use it. Okay, is it? Yeah, Raw, bro. Literally, we gotta we gotta put like I don't know how we talk about the Wii without talking about Wii Sports. Yeah. Wii Sports. Oh my goodness, <laughs> fam! I feel like getting it on my Switch just because of how good Wii Sports right. was. No, no, that no. that that I think that game was so underrated because it brought it brought people who were gamer gamers. With people who have no clue about gaming, and it made it fun. Like wait, like, no, no, like, it, flies like, under, like it flies under the radar. Like it's just well, I mean, people give it ratings, but I'm saying in terms of how it brings people together, it's not rated enough. I get that. I get Do you get it. what I'm saying? Okay. It's not yeah, rated yeah. enough. Yeah. Everyone's like, Wii Sports is great, mm -hmm. but we all could you could get your grandma involved in yeah. that. Someone who has no interest in digital games, and then she can get. In, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Top level people with people who have Bro, no clue about gaming. Do you know what? Actually, speaking of like grandparents, mm -hmm. what do you call it? Uh, I remember reading somewhere like this was time ago. Basically, this guy got his PlayStation, no, his Xbox 360, set up at his grandma's place, plugged in, what does it call it, Assassin's Creed. So and his grandma went and grandma, it, it. Yeah, no, literally, he like, gave it to his grandma, and his grandma's like running around like ancient Roman shit. <laughs> Bless her. Because she never went, because obviously she's like, oh, I want to go, but obviously she never went, and now she's too old. Like, mm. plugged it in, let her play Assassin's Creed, so she's just like free roaming, killing people while going around that's Roman a, shit. I mean, that, yeah. that's, that's, that's beautiful. Whoa, grandma, yeah, that's, grandma, that's beautiful, <laughs> you're killing people in Egypt. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I love you, grandma. Yeah. I well, actually follow an old huge, um, uh, older lady on YouTube. She's like in her eighties and nineties. Oh, this... she plays all those FPS games. And yeah, she goes, yeah, she's yeah, got yeah. mad yeah, yeah, collections. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> she's got mad collections. I was looking at her. I was like, rah. Yeah. This is the. This, I, I, I'm not gonna lie to you. Someone said, "Would you like to be born in this era? This era?" I'm like, as as, as shit as things are right now. This is probably one of the best times best to be time alive. To be alive technology, well. techn technology wise. I would yeah. run. A, I'd say probably be in my parents' generation. No, like no, no, no. My parents' generation, but on the younger bit. side. But on get, the younger I side. What, I get what you're saying. On the younger I side. I get what of you're it. saying. Like coming to your like late thirties to forties. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, but I have a house by now. If I did, so you know. <laughs> so, <Yeah. laughs> so put it this way: we are in that That's stupid. Into a no, 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 hold, hold, hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. So pretty much, we're in that stupid generation where we're too young for like cheap houses, mortgage. And we're too old for like this TikTok. Yeah, 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 yeah. We're that stupid. 
So basically, our IT classes was if you learn how to use Microsoft, bro, you're going places. Yeah, that's uh, it. Nowadays, Excel, you're going places. Now, no, no, actually, no cap. If you still, if you know Excel, actually, you're still going places. Yeah, yeah, no yeah, cap. True, yeah, but true, now, yeah. like kids in primary, like secondary schools, they got programming classes. Look, yeah, guys, that's true. we have to, we have to save this for a different episode because this, this, we, we're gonna go into this <laughs> yeah, one in a different yeah, yeah, episode. So yeah. this is why I say best generation would be. Parents' generation, but so eighties, just like early eight, like uh, late late eighties, like the, late late seventies, so the Atari, like 78 to so late, so no, no, so like the mid eight, Commodore sixty four, mid eight, like mid eighties, mid eighties. So you're like thirty. You know what? Because that's like I perfect. somewhat agree, only, but that that's a different. Thing. But purely for the fun and the level of things that you won't get. I mean, we can still get judged for a lot of things, but the things you get, I think our generation is perfect because we've seen. Technology that hasn't been fantastic, but not entirely shit. Yes. We didn't come in when them, them mans were carrying suitcases with yeah. a fuck off mobile like phone. You know what I'm saying? My mum yeah. told me she had one of those. I'm like, was that shit not heavy? The one we that came was in when they had snake. Bring the antenna yeah. out like that. We Screen had, was that we big. Had, we had the, 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 the computers with the back off. And we've seen the evolution in that. And we've still been able to keep up somewhat. Put it, mm. put it, put it this way. Some of the shit that we have, that we use technology-wise, is now in a museum somewhere in America. Which is wild. Have you so, you seen... remember the, so you remember those, those, those Apple pieces that had like the translucent cases? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Bro, literally, this one's going mad over like TikTok and freaking Twitter. It's in a museum now. They're like, this is old tech. Hey. Like, bro, this was like 10 years ago. When just, just 95, bro. I'm just going to ask. 98. I'm just going to say, hey, you see translucent cases on... They need to bring those back. They need to run them back. They need to run those back. With the colours If I had a switch that had a translucent case, you think I would have mashed that out every, every day. day. Yeah, you yeah, know what? Yeah, literally, yeah, like, yeah. even like I guess so it should be more relevant now because you know like, how people like now are more like techie. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, literally, can you imagine some like freaking like iPhone snob Clear cases, like, oh yeah, look at this. The, oh, uh, the that, that would slap. Camera, mm. the pro. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, oh, Apple, if you take this idea, I, I swear to God. We're trademarking that shit right now. We're that corporate that right now. We gave you that idea. We want to be an Apple ad or at least give us like bro, five bro. years worth no, 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 no. of iPhones. No, 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 okay. no, 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 no. iPhone that comes out, we get it for Wait, hold on. I must say this as a Samsung fanatic. Apple, leave me alone. Samsung, if you decide to do it, call it at me. <laughs> yes, Apple Samsung. Take them. Samsung, myself, yeah? Samsung, Samsung. Bro, Samsung, Samsung. The phone that is Samsung, recording Samsung. Samsung, Samsung. This Samsung. is Samsung. No. In, from, from trying to piss no me off. I've got the flip it. Where's my no headphones, bro? I've got no Samsung. Samsung here, fam. <laughs> bro. I'm a, I'm a real Samsung guy, bro. If Samsung you needs to sponsor you me. are locked into that ecosystem. I'm just saying. You know. No, fully I am. <laughs> fully. Bro, my TV, Samsung, oh, sound, but I got two Samsung hey, TVs no, you, at home, bro. You, you just Three to go Samsung TVs, actually. You already did the Samsung t- you- we need to let's move this is this where, where's, where's my tablet as well my tablet is samsung fam like bro nah, we I talked about all this shit samsung i, 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 I don't episode. rate i don't rate the samsung tablet everything else fine but i'm not i'm not gonna no. lie ipad ipad, iPad takes iPad. tablet wise ipad iPad. takes it hey listen tablet iPad. wise ipad takes it samsung Samsung, if you are watching, you see I'm loyal to the soil. Look, put me in an advert or something, that's all I'm saying. Let him talk his business. (laughs) When you want to go to your corporate clients, I go to Argos, it's an iPad. I go to Sainsbury's, it's an iPad. IPAD! Look, can you start padding into my microphone? You <laughs> just discussed. Alright, alright, let's move on quickly. Alright, yeah. Let's so, alright, so we've said game library, we're saying PS2, right? Yeah. What was the other thing we were saying? We were so, saying we, 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 we've said game library out is the box. PS2. Yeah, out of the box. We haven't done out of the box. Yeah, so no, 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 I think out you, out you box, just what asked what's the other category. So, yeah, yeah, so yeah, so yeah. library, out of the box. Out of the box. And then last innovation, which was we. Innovation. So, we're going to give And then you said there was another one. Okay, yeah, no. Wait, hold on. I going to make another category. Wait, 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 wait. I just want to go back to the to innovation for a second. I kind of want to argue for DS a little bit on this one. Just because I'm thinking... The touch and the gyro. Bruh. And like, they did a lot with it. Like, do you know how many people had DSs? Do you know how many people had multiple DSs? I had DSs, yeah. I mean, I went for it. Like, okay, so you see how you said with the Wii, right? How a lot of people picked up the Wii and like, it connected people in a big way. Mm. Like, the DS also did that. So for example, the Wii, like, mm. I remember my mom was like, Adrian, where can you get a Wii balance board from? And I'm like, what? And she's like, yeah, no, I want to do it for Exa. I'm like, what? Because, you know, she don't play video games. But then before even that, 
she had herself a DS to do like brain training and that on it. Mm. And I'm just thinking, you know, with like Nintendogs and the way the PlayStation um uh, Pokemon games evolved. Uh, just, and... just one second, one second. RIP to all those Nintendogs that just. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, just yeah. dogs. They got a bad name, fam. They have Them dogs are dead. Proper RIP PCCA, fam. They were puppies. All right, continue, continue. Well, I'm just saying, like, Ninte- the Nintendo DS and also just the creativity of the games that they had on the DS, but, like, boy, it was up there. When did the DS come out? Because I would argue... It came out a little bit before I would the Wii, argue, I want to say. I'd argue because Apple had come out with their phone, right? The iPod. iPhone. The yeah. I, what, the, no, iPhone? I thought iPod. Touch. No, iPhone iPhone was iPhone was iPhone came out. first because they still had the I like the old fashioned iPod which was the wheel. Yeah, but yeah. And then the second generation, so when it came to the second generation. Like, iPhone itself. Because yeah. I know I remember when I was school iPhone came out when I we was in second yeah, grade. Yeah, yeah. So I'm trying to gauge it because actually no the DS came out before. DS came out before. Oh, DS came out. The original clunky silverback <laughs> DS. That was uh, that was had a, yeah, edges. That <laughs> had edges. That big old blend. Yeah, yeah, bro. DS. I have to give it to him actually. DS. Might, I think the DS. I, I think it was more still Nintendo. Though. But but yeah, yeah, for but, sure. but, it's still Nintendo. But but what I will say is let's clarify it. We have to be. It's a console, but it's specifically a handheld. If we were gonna. I, I find handhelds are a different category. Okay, okay. Just purely because of their accessibility to move around. Okay. And in, within that market, there's been several competitors. Yeah. Going back from even the 80s, like yeah. Sega, uh, what's it called? Gear. Uh, Sega Game Gear. Game Gear, you yeah. know what I'm saying? So it's been that around for ages, Game Boy and stuff junk. like that. Got so that if we're that. talking about handhelds, I would 100% give it to DS. Mm, but if mm. we're talking pure home consoles, it would be Wii. Okay, but well, here's another thing I will chuck in. Okay, wait, no. All right. Innovation-wise, okay. right. nah. DS. No. Yeah. I was just going to say, what do you guys... Okay. Okay. What do you think is the best handheld console? However you want to define that. Because I... How about, we get to the, how about we get to the end? So we just yeah, go through... Yeah. Wait, let's just finish okay, off fine, the yeah, yeah, consoles yeah, yeah. bit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Then we can do the... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah fine. All right. Yeah, so what was the last thing then? It was... So we've done... We've done out of the box. Out of the box. Out of the box. Yeah. That's the one we need to do. Out of the box... So we're saying the best difficult. console out of the box. Is difficult for me. That one's hard for me because a lot of consoles, I don't know. I actually what, don't know. Okay, actually. so what are we defining as out of the box? Are we talking about the game library that they have accessible No, because to the game library is already the roster. So we're talking it's about just the tech. The, the, the tech itself. Out of the box for its time. And actually we can <clears> say in somewhat comparison to, to not the roster of games, but the kind of games I get would say Xbox Series X. Oh, I god damn it! I might have to agree with you. Mm. Out of the box, but, yeah. Out of the box, you but, know what I mean? Like, but, no, no, no. but, 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 <laughs> um, the only issue I would say is out of the box, you have to exclude Game Pass. Yeah, because that yeah, doesn't yeah, come yeah. out. That Even doesn't excluding come. Game Pass. Even excluding Game Pass. Because I think the controller solid. Um, one of the best controllers you'll ever. I'm enjoying, it. I'm enjoying it. Um, I'm enjoying don't it. have Xbox. The, don't the, care. The backwards compatibility straight out of the box is yeah. there. Yeah. Blah, 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 blah. You know, obviously 4K, 60 FPS, all that good stuff right there. And they did the um, two tier thing as well. So yeah. if you couldn't do the premium one, you could get the uh, S. Yeah, yeah. It does that as well, mm. right? Um, the and then just the fact that obviously you know the online capabilities with Game Pass. Oh, sorry, not Game Pass. Um, games with Gold and Game uh, Xbox Live. Mm. You feel me? But that's that's not out of the box. Out of the box is just as you get it. Okay, fine. But even... out of the box, even just as it is, <clears throat> there's so many free games to play. Because I went yes. to the free game section, and it's enough to get you involved. From Very Warframe, true. to Overwatch, to Apex. Mm-hmm. There's something for you. There's Fortnite, and I know Fortnite's yeah, quite but big. Yeah, but technically those are like cross-gen ones. So even they are like, cross-gen, so then... but it's still out of the box. This isn't about the game roster now. This yes. is just about the out of the box accessibility. So whether the games are exclusive or not, doesn't matter. This means you have access to yeah. a plethora like, of games. You, you can take an Xbox 360 disc and put it into the Xbox X. and it'll work. Yeah, uh, yeah. Xbox Series X and it'll work. That's the reason why I didn't put and PS5 there. And even Xbox One as well, right? Yeah. yeah. Like, like, all bro, you go, all that's what I'm saying. Like, all Xbox games. You can have an original Xbox game. Blix the Time Sweeper. You can take a Blix the Time Sweeper game. I tried to play that game and fuck me. I hate that game. <laughs> <laughs> that did not age well for me. <laughs> I need, I need this, to try here's it the thing. When it comes to those retro games, I tried to not touch them. Because it will take your memory away. I was like, apart from like the Pokemon games, mm-hmm. 
Like, you don't age well, bro. Like, <laughs> no, actually, I went back. I played. I played Tekken like on an emulator. Yeah, bro, that shit is blocky. Wait, which one? Tekken. Which Wait, yeah. original Tekken? The original Tekken. Oh, gosh, yeah, but it was no. always blocky. You, no, 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 no. But the thing like, is, we remember like the way we remember it isn't uh, isn't as blocky as it actually. Oh, is. in terms of the actual yeah. mechanics. No, no, just mechanics and the visuals. Oh, the visuals I understand because of the time, but the yeah. mechanics. No, no, but no, no, But the thing is, is the way you like if you never if you if you played Tekken when it came out originally, you never touched it again. And only played all the modern Tekkens, and you went back to it. You'd be like, ah, oh, you you have yeah, this modern shit. Tekken and in your head, and you go back into it. Then yeah, you go back to yeah. like, oh, this is bad, <laughs> the sort of thing. Yeah, I would argue though the PS2 roster still bangs, even when you know, like for a good example, playing Kingdom Hearts on that before they released the ultimate no, but, collections and stuff like. But that. the thing is though, with like the thing is though, with PlayStation Two, it's kind of the updated. Like it's the sec it's the second wave of three. Oh, so games. you're just talking about the original PS one games and yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I get you. So like, I get you. when I you get go you. back, back, I get you. And you yeah. just From, to the beginning, back into time. Mm. Way like, back, Mario like Mario Kart sixty four, and you play on the Wii. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mario Kart eight is just a different ball game. Yeah, it's a different ball game. Bro, Massive. I literally sixty four still slaps. No cap, no slap. It still slaps, but it's hella blocky. I would argue, I wonder if that's the skill level of how games are made more fluid. Because if if we had an EMP bomb that wiped out all the modern games, we would still enjoy that. We would we'd be frustrated by it in the beginning, but once you get over the, the level of difficulty... Because I remember well, going back to some... Well, technically, if it was an EMP, it would have wiped them out. Well. I know, I know. That's why I said modern oh, games. I tried to be specific. <laughs> technically, I know, technically, technically, I know, I know. As soon as I was saying it, I was waiting for someone to give me the fucking... They Technically, if we were, if, it, if the EMP thing happened, bro, we're back on the road. We're playing football. We're riding our bikes. We're playing I'm football on the road. Football, but yeah, but yeah, no, but we're doing sports. Yeah, running around the park. Football. Chasing girls. <laughs> Can't one. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, yeah. All right. So accessibility. I mean, out the box. Uh, out the box. Out the box. I, I probably to, would, I would get. Yeah. I would agree with him because even the the PS Slim, PS Five. Nope. I'm not feeling what PS5... I feel like they swap, swap places. This is Yes. Like, and I don't want to go too deep into this, but it used to be Sony was the champion of gamers. Mm -hmm. And I feel like they've swapped with yep. Microsoft. Yep. Actually, not too and fair. Microsoft I guess, like, are... I think one thing, one thing I guess that's really changed is obviously the... I guess Microsoft has a lot more buying power now than it did before. So does Sony, though. Sony is... No, 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 no. But the thing is, Sony, Sony has never had the intention to buy... Uh, development studios. Oh, true. Yeah, yeah, you're right. So literally, it would. So, it, so I'm Sony. You're, I don't know, you're Square Enix. Or Activision. Keys, whatever. Activision. Whatever. He goes. All right. I want you to make a game for me. We'll commission you. I don't know. Four games. Here's your money. Mm. I commission you to make a game. That's your money. The only reason why Sony is now buying developers is because Xbox. Because Microsoft, Microsoft are going. Yeah. I want you. I want yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. I want and you. I want you. They bought so, in so order, much. So in order for Sony to have. Any developers make PlayStation games. They have to buy. Mm. Yeah. So if it, so, but back is, in the days when it was like Xbox 360, PS2, which I think is going to make in the long run, oh, go back, they're gonna make worse games. Oh no, definitely, like one hundred percent. There'll be some good bangers from those who have always who've who've always so put it this way, muscles. But so put it this way. So if it's triple AAA titles, but obviously if it stays as console exclusives, mm -hmm. they will be good. And then as soon as they release that cross-platform one, mm -hmm. they're just going to make it a mockery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, Fully because they can. You know with 2K, bruv, NBA. Mm. Some of them just have been appalling. Bruv, you don't FIFA, need to but no, but 2K, but the thing Some is, no, 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 so no, 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 but 2K is different though. 2K isn't owned by... One it's, or the other, yeah. It's no, no, it's no, no, cross-platform the game, isn't it, no? Yeah. Yeah, no, but no, no, no. The you reason mean, oh, also that it's available on different. This is what I'm saying. Yeah, no, no, no. But I'm saying is because no. So basically, let's take Activision for instance. Yeah, yeah. So if because Microsoft bought Activision, basically they just have Call of Duty. That's it. Yeah, yeah. So they can just make a banging Call of Duty for Xbox players and PC players. But then when they release the cross-platform one, because they own it, they just go, yeah, his, and then 64 version of it. I, I don't they know. They won't, but they can't. When they're within their rights to do so. I know they're well within their rights to, but I don't know because I feel like. Maybe it's the current generation of gaming and the tech advancements. Cross-platform games before, even if you weren't playing online together, there was still a standard where it had to be released to be a good game. For no, the but that's my point. But it's because when it was Xbox and PlayStation 2, it was individual development studios Yeah. that went, oh, I'm making a game, so let's just take uh, Need for Speed. I've made Need for Speed. I got, actually, I want to get this out there. So, Sony, I'm going to sell it to you. 
uh, Microsoft will give it to you. Sell my game. Go. So the the quality of the game is done by the developer himself. Yeah, and if they were shit, but then now, they would suffer the ramifications. So now if Adrian has bought my development studio, Adrian goes, I want you to bang out a game. You've got six months to bang a game out. You bang the game out. Okay, six months, bring the next one out. So I've just got to bang, 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 bang. Because uh, yeah. he's telling yeah, me yeah, to yeah, do yeah, so. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he's but as an, indi- as an independent developer, I can go, you know what? I'm going to spend two years on this game. Give it out. All right, let it sit in the market for, I know, one, two years. All right, that, in, that two year, in that two year cycle where it's out on the market, I've got two years as a developer to make the next installation of the game. Mm. Which is why you get with FIFA, 2K, Call of Duty, uh, what other like EAD games are there? Madden. Madden. FIFA. WWE yeah. where it's just literally more or less a rehash of the same game with like a little bit of with, with like literally, Koei, Koei literally, Tecmo's literally, uh, literally, literally well. all it is is mm. <laughs> it's literally just sweat mo- sweat <laughs> <laughs> just dripping sweat that Jordan Peele sweat sketch visuals. that Jordan Peele sketch yeah. where he's just yeah. dripping yeah. water from his face yeah. literally with no, added sweat <laughs> but literally it's just rehash 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 yeah. just because it's it's a case of it's revenue and market share they're going for rather than and actual innovation and and this is now this is that also leads into the problem of microtransactions and DLCs. Let's not like yeah, we've gone too far. We've gone too far. That's a different topic. That's that's a lot, I'm, and I oh, I hate microtransactions with that. Like, but fully, like as from a business standpoint, I fully get them. Like, props to the company yeah, for doing it. Still, fuck but them. fuck your microtransactions. Yes, we hate them. All right, so the last one uh-huh. and I think we should wrap up is handhelds. Handhelds. What best handheld? Yeah. All right. So this is what I was gonna ask. Yeah. yeah. So. But the, but to be fair, when it comes to handhelds, Nintendo has overwhelming. Yeah. No. Of that's but numbers. This, but, yeah, but, yeah. but this is the thing. In terms of the, I actual, think just yeah, yeah. this is the thing. I would say the PS Vita. I was gonna say PSP. No PSP. I can. I would put the PS Vita over the PSP just simply because the PSP had a very very limited library of games. Mm. Yeah, okay, but the so PS Vita had an even more limited library. Yeah. And no, I, but I, the PS like PS Vita, you had the option to go but, digital with the game. But so you yeah. could do that with PSP as well, because no, 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 I no, downloaded no, no, no. Power Stone on it. No, but that's not a box. You had to download an extra No, you had to do that with PS Vita as well. Yeah, well, no, no, with no, PS Vita. No. Oh wait, no, 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 no PS Vita you didn't need to have a No, you, you had could, to No, you didn't need to you didn't need to add an extra feature for you to play games virtually. No, no, you can. No, no, the PSN network, you could go on the PSP and download games. No, but when that was up, that was that was retconned after. So when the PSP first came out, mm-hmm. you could only buy the UMD. You could do the little yeah, UMD yeah, yeah, thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you could only play and you could actually only play like LAN or Yeah, because I don't I don't I don't but remember. You couldn't play games virtually unless you obviously you jail well, you jailbroke it. We yeah, because I was oh, talking about virtual. I was just talking about actually downloading and buying a digital. Oh no 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 no! I meant like you couldn't play digitally Wait. until, but that was added later on. With PSP, I can't, I genuinely can't remember. With PSP, did they? Ha- I don't think they had a storefront, did they? Nope, they didn't. Yeah, they didn't have a digital. In the beginning, I don't think so. No, no. they didn't. So no, they everything did later was, on. Yeah, yeah they re- on. like I said, they retconned it after later yeah. on. Yeah. After they, because basically what happened was they brought off. Yeah, they they did the PS Vita, and then they went, oh, actually, this online library is pretty sick. PSP had some bangers. And for some reason, PSP out of nowhere decided to have a spike of sales. And yes, hmm. they did because I bought so many games. <laughs> yeah, and then basically because of those spike in sales, they're like, "Oh, we can actually do like a digital storefront because they already had it." And then they just retconned it in and just put it as a firmware update. I am going to throw the Steam Deck in. I knew you would. And I, and and the reason why I say that is because it's the culmination of all of them. They're better handheld PC sort of like console hybrids. But for what it does and everything you get out of the box, it's almost like they've taken all the things that everyone has done and squeezed it into this thing. It's not perfect, but it's it's already it's already it's it's to stabilize the market mm. to the point where you can sorry Nintendo, we can emulate your games. <laughs> Fuck the shit you're doing on your <laughs> shitty hardware. Steam Deck is putting fire on your ass, <laughs> and now you have to get out there. This is the truth. And what's happened is they started off small and people were like, it's not going to blow. But the numbers have been growing. Mm. It's been growing. And I reckon if it has the same sort of longevity the Switch does for the their thing first is, I, don't, edition, I don't think it will have the longevity. I think it will be literally a boom and then it will kind of... I don't know because the, what's happened is when they first... I did my pre-order in 2021 and it was only available in three regions, mm. which was America, the US, Europe and Australia. Yeah. They've now expanded to Hong Kong. They're expanding markets to different and Japan very like Yeah, but no, 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 even though they do if they do expand the markets, mm. I don't think Steam Deck in itself will have 
the longevity of sales. So basically, when it gets released, mm-hmm. you'll have madness. Just people like, yes, 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 yes. So like, I don't know, for a year, year and a half, bang it's been sales. over that now, though. I've it's got been a question. over than that. I've got a question. Just because I've not had any experience with a Steam Deck, I must brought it but, today as well. You know, but <laughs> why do you bring it? I'm sorry. But I should use it to you. Here, here's the thing: <laughs> the that... part of Steam Deck. Hold on, look, yeah. <laughs> no, this is the thing. This is excuse the... me, Adrian. Do you have time for a little? <laughs> yeah, 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 this Steam is a bad bit about Steam Deck and how <laughs> no. it can change your life. So this is the thing about Steam Deck. Live a better life. Wait. So this is the thing about Steam Deck, right? That that this is the reason why I don't. I'm not interested in the Steam Deck, basically. As far as I'm aware, as I'm aware, mm. and feel free to correct me on this, but it's just basically a handheld PC, essentially, right? Yes. And all it does is emulate games that have come out on other stuff. No, 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 no. no. Okay, so what's the deal with that? Then? So does the Steam Deck have original games? Yeah. Yes. Because basically okay. you have... And how so many basically... of them are good? Loads! Oh. So, so, okay. put it, so put it this well, way. I think the funny thing about Steam is... Most of the good games are done by these like budget guys who just like indie indie developers. Yeah, yeah, indie so indie so developers. they so they champion the indie gamers, but I'll yeah. even yeah, say yeah, more fine. than that because even if you talk about even if they don't have exclusives, which most people are into, but let's let's be real. If you didn't have exclusives, a good game's a good game. Yeah. Right? Yes. So here when you, this is where it gets interesting because because it's this PC world, people are like, it's not gonna come, but it's already doing that because it's almost like what they've done is they've taken a PC, overlaid console structures and ideas on top of it mm-hmm. and launched it out and what it does what they've done that i don't think any other console they've given you as the consumer all the freedom to do whatever you want okay without needing to do jailbreaking and stuff you want yep. you want an os on that you want apple os you can do it you want windows on that os you want that you want to have a desktop version of it and just play like desktop stuff and do work? You can do that. Mm. You want to play hardcore first person shooters? You can do that. Indie games, you can do that. Now, when it comes to the marketability of our games, games are cheaper on PC. Yeah. The amount of sales that, that do you know how many games Free. I've gotten? <coughs> <laughs> Bro, the amount of games I've gotten on the Steam library, I've probably spent about 200 since I've gotten it. If I was to buy those games fresh or buy them on consoles, I'd probably you have like four, four games. Them. Yeah, three or four of them. Not That's even. what... <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And that that therein lies where the more benefits come in. Mm. They got the gyros down. They got the touch screen down. Mm. So they've taken stuff that Switch did and exponentially made it better. Okay. The only issues and the drawbacks that people do talk about is the battery life. Yeah. But, but then I guess that comes with obviously how much tech they're holding in it. This is the thing. But, but that's why I'm saying they did a great balance of it because there's actually other players. I think Ioneo, which is a Chinese company yeah. that does a handle, they've got a more powerful system. But just for the sole fact, out of the box, it's paired with the actual Steam purchasing platform. You have access. Dude, I have I bought Neo. I bought Neo 1 and 2. Mm. It works fantastic. If you find your game is lagging or you're having certain issues... You as the user, if you have no fucking clue, just play it out of the box. But if you know a little bit or you want to learn, you're willing to learn some coding or learn how to get the best out of your gameplay, you are now open to a world where this thing can introduce you to how to actually mod your games, make sure that, oh, I don't want to play at 30, I don't mind playing at 60. You know what I'm saying? You have so much control. See, that was what I was going to ask then. So, um, you know... The accessibility for it, as let's say you're not really a gaming person, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Is the Steam Deck suitable for that type yes. of person? Yes, 100%. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 100%. Yes. It goes from your hardcore people who like gaming, who want to code Linux. Mm. You can even, like, um, from what I've checked, although you might need to do a bit more modding of the actual hardware, mm. which even that is easy. They When they released their... Um, I think they even, they've even got, like, they even got like FAQs on how to do it. Yeah. Oh, like, like, literally, yeah, they tell you, they literally tell you how to mod it. I, I'm, so, I'm so pissed. I wish I brought my Steam Deck because if you want to emulate, it's never been easier. They've got one thing called... Ah... Um, oh, Rom, I don't know if it's called Romulinux Linux or something, or e- Emu Deck. Emu Deck. Okay. You download this one thing, it gives you access to all, all of the emulators that are out that work on the platform. You don't mm. need to do nothing, bar maybe a few things like maybe downloading the BIOS and stuff. But again, yeah, I think probably, so. The only other thing is you need to obviously down, need to download the actual game file itself as well, and mm. also you need to own the game to do that. Wink, wink. Piracy, hard. Yes, yeah, because that, that was the last thing I was gonna ask about the Steam Deck just mm. cuz again I don't have any experience with it so like owning games on it and like the legitimacy of owning games and stuff cuz I, I feel that 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 it 
it opens itself up for a grey area in that regard. But, so, are but, you talk- but, so are you talking about the terms of what, I think it was Microsoft are doing it, where it's, you when you buy the game, you don't buy a copy of the game. You buy the license. You buy the license yes. Yes. to play the game. Yeah. But let's, so essentially, if you bought the CD for eight, like for FIFA, mm-hmm. you can't go to uh, CEX, so I want to sell this. Mm-hmm. And they go, well, we can't accept it because you don't own the game. Yeah, yeah. I don't know if that's what, I don't know. Is that, that what you were trying to get on? Like, uh, you own the license to the game rather than Or was it more copy? the piracy thing? More the, the piracy only, side, only the copy. yeah. See, but that, that really depends on, I guess, you know, the viewers and the individual mm. who are, are you bothered about that? Let's be mm. honest. How much is, is the international Nintendo swap force going to be checking each man's house? Each, to, each Steam Deck. Each Steam Deck mm. to see what they're doing. The most well, they've to, been able to, to do... Fair, it be, if we look at this logically, it wouldn't actually be that hard. It would literally be like... Four lines of code. What to check? Yeah. Which, it, but, but I mean, to then police the actual individuals, all those who are taking part in in emulating games they don't actually physical own. It's 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 more. It costs more. It would probably cost them more to 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 sort well, of. Well, not issue... no, So so it, in terms of to check, it would be relatively cheap to enforce. But that's what I'm saying. Oh, to actually yeah, enforce, yeah, to enforce it, it. Then to yeah. be like, hey, we want you to stop cease and desist. Otherwise, these are the ramifications. Mm. That's costing way about... We're looking yeah. at probably trillions because you're talking about people globally around the world. Now, if you want to send posts, let's just follow it through. I want to post to each person. How do you know these people are living at those addresses? How do you know they're going to even pay attention to it? Then to then start taking people to court, litigation. It's too well, much even, money. Actually, what they could do is just literally just lock the console and just brick it. But how would you brick... How would you... But then... How do you brick that you hardware can't, though, you couldn't not brick, You couldn't brick a Steam Deck. Because now they're coming into the territory of hardware that belongs to someone else. Yeah. No, so, so, be basically, so basically you might own the hardware, but you can break the software itself. So pretty much... So breaking the code. Yes. But then, but then there'll then be people who'd work around that. Do you see what I'm saying? And even so then... So it's, it's a forever going... You would route. have to like reverse engineer basically some of these games and stuff. Like you'd have to go back into an old like Mario Kart, for example, and, th- and like... Work the brick back into that, but again, it, you know even I mean? with that, it's not. But even it's then, not, but to be fair, if we, if we were to go down that route, some dude in China's probably done it already. This, <laughs> but this is what I'm saying. Some dude in China has already done it. And and even if they wanted to go down that route, remember, there's people who, out of the pure passion and love of coding and mm-hmm. hacking, will find a way to make it work. Oh, that's yeah. the, that's the reason part oh, of the yeah. reason why we have the emulation community that we have today. Mm-hmm. There are people who are still patching then, PS3 then, emulation. Yeah, and mean, then, on, but then again, but then one, on top but of the thing is though, but on top of that, general, like, generally speaking, the emulation community, mm-hmm. they aren't those, like those toxic kind of guys. Yeah. Yeah. That's the thing. Yeah, yeah. Like, they're not like thieves and crooks that give gamers a bad name. They're mm-hmm. the guys who go into games and are patching them like they're making them better. Yeah, yes. they're preserving making them the games, run better. Yeah, like yeah. all that stuff. You yeah. know when um, Nintendo Switch released their was it the N N sixty four emulation? Yeah, mm. the amount of people that came out, this is trash. You can play this emulation better on other things with the emulations that were made by the the homebrew community. Mm, yeah, and then Nintendo released this like, I mean they they've made it better since, but when they first released it, I remember going on YouTube and people were like, this is terrible. The ports that they have made in terms of emulating to make it work on the Switch work way, way, way like uh, less efficiently mm. than it would on a PC or even on another uh, like a jailbroken iPhone or something. Yeah. Mm. Or a Samsung, do you know what I'm mm. saying? Android mm. phone. Mm. So I would say the Steam Deck only because it's it's taken all the innovation, it's paired with a massive platform for gaming mm-hmm. that is for gamers of every level, bro. I'm talking uh, there's hentai game. There's idle games. There's everything you can imagine under the sun at cheaper price points than you would get if yeah, they yeah. were released on thingy. The only other thing that I could say that would take handheld gaming away would be mobile phones. Mobile phone gaming market is the hugest market that exists. Yeah, it is. It's actually... It's, actually it's the a... hugest game market that exists. But then would you actually consider that a... But then... To but, do console. But to, but to be fair, it's not... I'd say the mo- well, mobile gaming, as much as it's on the rise... Mm-hmm. It's not the phone isn't designed for gaming. That's what I'm saying. So I wouldn't. I'm, even though, so even though there are thing. so even though there are mobile phones that obviously like are specific like for, gaming phones. Yeah, yeah. yeah so, I'd, I'd still but, be like, but then, phone, but then, yeah. but here the thing: it's a phone. It's a phone. Yeah. As soon was, as I hear phone, it's, like, it's a phone. First yeah. and foremost, it's a phone. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. it's not actually a handheld console. Yeah. yeah. So I, mean, I can't get my DS 
And also, 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 even though I could, like, because I think there is like a soft, yeah, 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 there's yeah, a software yeah, on there where yeah. you can actually like call someone. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh really? Yeah, you can actually contact somebody like on like Skype. Use... Doop, doop. Yeah, yeah, no, no. So something like a quote like the Nintendo or Skype, okay. but you can do that. But but see, here's the thing as well with phone, right? Phone. If we're thinking of like prolific phone games. Mm-hmm. The last one I can really think of as like a prolific phone game, I'm not even 100% sure, but I'm, I'm thinking like stuff like Among Us and CSGO. No, you know CSGO. Mean? Genshin, 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 Impact. Genshin, Genshin Impact. Or Genshin, Genshin no, no, Impact. No, so CS, CSGO's PC, Among yeah. Us is, yeah, mobile, yeah. yeah. Yeah, but like those are like the most prolific phone games I can and, think and of. And there's a few. You have Temple Run, um, Angry Birds. Pokemon, uh, yeah. Pokemon Go. Yeah, yeah. Pokemon Go. Um, but I, I guess then the, I guess if we're talking about that then we'd have to crush. clarify I think I would just then clarify it as if we Fruit talk Ninja. about numbers that it draws mobile phones they're not consoles but they do take it in terms oh, of yeah, gaming especially but, like especially like now they've got like friggin like Call of Duty Genshin Impact yeah yeah I forgot Pokemon, Fortnite Pokemon, Pokemon PUBG, Unite PUBG, PUBG Fortnite yeah, 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 yeah. like Apex. phones are now more capable of playing these better games and yeah. stuff but like still at the end of the day though console. like yeah it's not console yeah. and and when we're talking about like bruv I'm not like I know there's a bunch of people that play games on phones mm. and there's like even me I play like mm-hmm. like you know Mobile Legends is what I play on on my phone but like I, I don't like phones in my opinion they will never ever have the the buzz the love the adoration as literally every other platform yeah. just because they... i would slightly disagree just because of the because of the Actually, genshin impact no, no, no. game you say you know genshin... i guess you say that now but if you go to like if you go to china for instance okay so many people and so many people just on the phone yeah, 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 yeah. and if you think about it like like china's like essentially a third of the world's population. Yeah, yeah. no, it is. And they just, but Japan point. as well. Like, even the Dragon Ball Z, Dragon Ball Z, Dokkan, oh, all yeah. those other games. Dokkan, they were fam. Dokkan, the, 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 the other, the other one. Yeah, that, that was it. <laughs> no, no. I'm, and like, the other one, I remember the other one, day, one day, I can't remember it, right? Legend. Has, that was it. Dragon Ball yeah, yeah, Dragon Ball Legend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was like shit. I know, because you played that. Yeah. Religiously. That shit was fire. I'm going to I played it for like a week and I was like, yeah, I played it for a week and a The only game that has, I I, has stayed it. with me as a mobile game to this day, and it was the it was the it was the pre probably the pre successor to Genshin Impact was Honkai, Honkai Impact. Impact. Yeah, that game to this day it, it's become ridiculous because the amount of gigabytes <laughs> you need to download this game, and they're still making it fresh. I've just come back to it after almost a year. Are they break, making a new one? They're making yes, yes the yes, railroad yeah, like, yeah, 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 star something, star rail or something like that. Yeah, I think it's star rail. Yeah, yeah, I've already put myself as a pre-order for it because I'm already interested. Of course you have. Yeah, yeah, of course yeah. you have. See, like, here's the thing though. But the thing is, like, with mobile, like for me, mobile games, like the games I play on my mobile are just like time wasters. Time wasters. Yes, yeah. most times. So like, literally, I can get. Actually, let me just get my phone out and show you. So, like, like literally, it's that, so that, like I, literally that's the thing with like, gaming. I've got like free cell, one more brick, which is just like. Like yeah, yeah, old fashioned brick, brick, brick. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you got Nine Up, which is kind of just like a puzzle game uh-huh. where you just waste time. Cake Sort is just literally Candy Crush, but you just like Cake Sort, bro. You, you are way like more literally, nice, like I just play dumb games just to waste time. Yeah, yeah. Like, like, well and truly, the only like it's only for when I'm traveling that I use my phone to game. Yeah. So the only time I actually use it is like when I sit on the shoe. I used to be an avid mobile gamer, and I will show you the fucking. <sighs> I don't know if I could ever say I was avid. You have... Bro, what's yeah. with all these lollies on there, man? What lollies? They're all lollies! What lollies? He's trying to, <laughs> trying to make me out to something else I'm not being, bro. They, they are, are all lollies! They're not lollies, bro. All of them are small anime girls! Blo- balloons. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, bro. You, man. I'm sending that part. I'm sending that part. So I'm going to just... Uh, so, so, yeah. so, I'm throwing my hand in the ring for Steam Deck. I'm moving on. Now. Uh, cool. Move phone. Yeah, I think, I think, yeah. So, so handhelds. You're saying the best handheld is for Steam me Deck. at the moment because yeah. of it's what it's doing to the market. Mm, mm. Yeah, I, I think it's I shaking to, it up. Because originally I was gonna say Game Boy, but uh, I have to give it to Steam Deck. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, oh wait, oh, no, wait. First off, are we speaking Game Boy or Game Boy Color? Game, Game Boy. Boy Advance. Now, do you know what? Okay. I, I, feel know, I, Game Boy I, feel, I feel the Game Boy Color was better than the Game Boy Color. Removing though. the Steam Deck out just because it's a recent edition. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Going back to some of the old traditional handhelds. I'm, well, I said PSV. But the problem is, is the tradition, if we're going back to traditional handhelds, 
it's just literally it's all Nintendo. Yeah. No. Yeah. No. For the. For no. The, no. 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 no, no. I get what you're saying because as kings of it, as yeah, as they were going successfully yeah, no, for Yeah, but time. then when PSP came in, PSP was but, but, pressure. But 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 no, PSP, but PSP was never, pressure. But it never took that, the market though. It never took the market. No, it, okay. It, it PSP. Ne- no. PSP didn't take the market for uh, against the DS, but that was because it was the fucking. But DS. even even without the DS. The numbers of like, for, remember, after Game Boy Advance, it was Game Boy Advance SP yeah. with the backlight, right? Yeah. With the flip, with the flip yeah, one, yeah, yeah. right? So they had different iterations of that. That was still selling. Even Game Boy Advances were still going on uh, when the PSP came out. And this then is with they the dropped 3DS. the DS uh, and the decline DS of the, P- and and the, the PSP. The DS and then the Vita trying to came out, tried to come out and make its head, but people were still on the DS. So for King of Handhelds, it's always been mostly... Okay, all right, yeah, I'm, okay, okay. I'm, not, I'm, not, I'm not saying that, but I'm saying just as better... I, I want to say out-of-the-box experience, like better hardware, like PSP and PS Vita in terms of just like their straight-up hardware. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm, 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 I'm going to say to him... Yes, and also the fact that you could watch films because I used to download and watch films. And I watched Fam. all the police stories from Jackie Chan Fam. on my PS. And you see PS. I took it on the go. But, 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 no, but the thing is, is, though, you like if you get like, I get why you like PSP like to download movies and shit. But why would you watch it on a PSP when you have what you have your iPhone, you have uh, iPad. iPhone, iPhones weren't weren't. As popular then, the only iPads, yeah, at least on PSP. Times, no, but yes. even iPads, iPads were because I didn't get an iPad till way after. I had well, a PSP. That's you because you were we were kids then. No, 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 no. What? Bro, I'm 32. I'm fine. I'm not two years old. Man. It's actually <laughs> two, two years. Seen, so he's gonna use that. I've seen two years more days than you. <laughs> I see like 28 days more than this guy. <laughs> Wait, it's not 28, is it? Like it's like no, 13, it's 12, isn't it? Like 13 days. I'm, no, I'm the 20th. What's your birthday again? Eight. Yeah, 12 yeah. days, bro. Exactly. I'm only the 12 days of Yeah, bro, yeah. just 12 days. Yeah, senior's bro. still your senior, yeah, young exactly. boy. Wait, young, young blood. blood. Hey, look, listen. Young look. blood. All right, look, listen. All you men saying this with all this chest shit, I'm taller than all of you, so what? And so what? You're we still younger than legs, isn't it, bro? <laughs> them, them 12 years younger, 12 days younger legs get sweet. <laughs> <laughs> You might be you might be the youngest one here, but my knees are still fresher than you. Hey, shut, leave me alone. Look, what I'm saying is, yeah. Wait, I want to answer this question though. Yeah, go ahead. Because I had I, I bought an iPad for my uh, not an iPad. Um, it was the I don't know if it's a sixth generation iPod. Yeah. The, the normal one, and I used to watch films. It was small. Yeah. When I got the PSP, that was the biggest thing you could watch on the go. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, that on. is true. That and is true. And the, the DS didn't have that function. They no. weren't doing films nope. like that. Jimmy so the multimedia don't. function the of the PSP is really good. You could put music. Bro, music. On there you could put the internet. No, but on the it. problem was no, no. But the thing Bro. is, is oh, but the problem was is yeah. you could go on the internet on the PSP and that was hard. Some of the things we saw. Hey. But one thing, though, but one thing though, hey. is like when it comes to downloading stuff onto the PSP, you needed to have the card, the SD card. Yeah. And back in those days, we did we don't have yes. the crazy sizes we have now. No, we yes. did not. So, so with the biggest, no, so basically, I think the biggest one there was was five twelve. Yeah, five twelve megabytes. And that was uh, that was. And that's basically. And that that that's basically. And also, it was. It yeah, was. Um, if you, but then, if, if you're watching it was videos, specific for the PSP and, as well. Yeah, no, no, it's a specific. Yeah, it's a PSP specific. Yeah, it was the memory stick, uh, Pro Duo. I think it was. Yeah, yeah. So but, you then, had to but, buy, yeah. but then, yeah, so yeah, obviously, yeah, the biggest one you could get, I think, towards the end of it, you could get one gig. One terabyte, I swear. No, nah, no definitely terabyte. not a terabyte. Gig. It would have been gig. Was it a yeah. gig? Yeah. 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 So basically, yeah. Yes. but then if you think about it, if you put, if obviously if you put game saves, movies, music, whatever, that 512, this appears it yeah. straight it away. It does, but I guess, I guess then this comes into that whole thing of how you use your PSP because if you yeah, were doing no, no, everything no. digitally, because I had a lot of UMDs I'd bought, and again, the, the game, the game, but the me- my man. Even speaking of the UMDs, though, bro. Yeah, the little, the but, little, but the fam, little flat thing, yeah. But fam, <laughs> let's not. Let, but speaking on UMDs as well, let's be real. Them UMDs were bad. Like they, they were, they not, were horrible. They, to be fair, they, they look mean, sick. Yeah, they look. They great, look great, but, but they were a horrible oh. form to Do you know like what play it was? games. I felt like I understood the sort of idea behind it because it had that. It had a little part where you could the, the laser could read the disc. Yes. And most of it was covered. Yes, and yeah. I think what they were trying to do was to Protect prevent scratching. Yeah, yeah, the brain it just ended up like when it was busted, you could not clean it properly. Yeah, mm-hmm. but it was done. But the other, yeah. the, but the other thing what I didn't like about the PSP was like the tr- like the tray that holds. Yes, that oh, little slide. Little it, it, yeah. it is so prone to breaking. Yes, mm. it was. It was. Mm. So literally, you'd have to. 
Like one drop, you'd have to put the rubber band on it. I yeah. remember, I remember one of my guys. Pull the rubber band to the side. He ended, up just, getting rid of it. he ended up just getting rid of it. Went, during That's the later crazy. years, broke off the back. Yeah, is it? And just digitally gained. Because it was wow. it fucked him. See, because so so this is why personally I would put PS Vita over PSP because it, it was innovated on the PSP yes, in every way. Mm. You know what I mean? It was better than the PS. It was literally superior to the PSP in every way. And the only thing that held the PS Vita back was the library of games. Yeah. Otherwise, that console there was clear. I, and personally, I think it was clear of the entire market in terms of just quality. Because of the I, OLED screen. Yeah. Because the, the screen, the touch screens, the two sticks that you had. So you had um, left and right stick on that. Oh, I forgot they did that. You had that. the triggers yeah, yeah, yeah. on it. Like, bro, and everything is solidly built. If, if you hold a PS Vita to this day, it still feels fantastic to hold. It, it's so comfortable. It works just well, the speaker quality is actually pretty damn good on it. Like it, and yeah, think about yeah, it as well. When the PS Vita came I'll out, I'll bring that Steam Deck for you so you can see the speaker. Come, on. but <laughs> PS Vita, you got to think as well. It came out in the times of the PS3, and it was compatible with like the PS4. I remember, yes, because he uses you can the, the, the controller. controller. Yeah. Yes, yeah. controller. like it, and it worked well enough. You feel me? Like that's how ahead of its time it was. Versus the 3DS, which was like a dip, because the DS was like. Premium. Yeah, then they went and the, the 3DS, 3DS wasn't then 3DS wasn't as good. XL. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah they all of that they, was, they weren't as good as the DS. Which I feel, I think people are worried they might do with the Switch because they have already shown they've done that. The Switch Lite, I could understand. Yeah. But then Switch OLED? No. Terrible. Dumb my side, dude. They didn't need They just that. removed bezels. Yeah. Bro. They just removed bezels. They're and going they, on that iPhone route. And they charged, yeah. how, and they charged <laughs> how much for that motherfucker? I don't you know. know. I mean? like, I don't it's know. About, it's like £260 for an OLED. Bro, for, for, for simple fancier screen, bro. It plays the same games that my regular Switch does. No uh, no actual hardware update. No updates. Like, here's the thing as well. You see how with, like, the new Nintendo 3DS, for example, mm. right? Because remember, you had the 3DS, then the, the new, new Nintendo. Nintendo 3DS, yeah. So it had, like, the C-Stick and all that sort of yeah, stuff, yeah, right? Yeah. And, and it had the ZL and ZR buttons, right? So you had certain games that were made specifically for that. It was very limited. But there were specific ones for that, right? Where it was like optimized for that Almost console, like a call whatever, back to whatever. The, N64 in some sense. the OLED ain't got none of that. Yeah, it doesn't. I mean, the OLED is literally just better screen. You feel me? It it's 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 like a worse version of something like a PS4 Pro, because the PS4 Pro will obviously give you more processing power, will run quicker, yada yada, this and that. But at the end of the day, it's still a PS4. Yeah, yeah. But like, you know what you're getting with that. You you know what you're buying into on that one. If you have a Switch. And unless you are gaming with that Switch a lot, handheld specifically, mm. there ain't no damn point getting one. You either have to have a Switch Lite or, like I said, old thing, old Switch. Like the, the, like the, the one I've one. got the that doesn't one. have the optimized battery. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, You'd have yeah, to have yeah, one the of them I got the second to one potentially one. justify getting an OLED. But otherwise, there ain't no reason to get an OLED if you already have a Switch. No way. I, yeah. I, I, fair enough, fair enough. But, I mean... I think I think I'll just say for me, even though I do agree with PSV Vita, I'm looking at the roster and the childhood yeah, the thing of it. Shit. Game Boy Advance just smashed it for me, or at least the Game Boy SP. But I didn't like the Game Boy Fold that that mm. factor. If they put really? that inside, I really didn't like that. Hmm. And anyway, it gave it a smaller thing, yeah. and I enjoyed how the the ergonomics of the Advance. Is it? I'm, I'm, the, I'm the complete opposite. Fact, I didn't like the like the the but the ergonomics of it, but the, the the shoulder the, buttons, yeah, yeah them shoulder horrible. buttons, were yeah, they were. horrible. They were. they were terrible. But yeah, no, because I'm fam. You, you man had no backlight, fam. Fucking peasants. Yeah, no, what? Buying Fuck. the backlight. <laughs> no, bro. Your shit look like a transformer by the time you put every, you put on the rechargeable battery, and that. then you the magnifying the, screen, the, yeah, the side speakers, the, bro. The light. That shit it. was crazy, I fam. You would so have a kids today will not do not know what the, the stress of the, playing fam. the Game Boy with the street lights. You yeah. had the GPA. The street lights. And by the time you put all your attachments on, the thing was a chunk like this big. Yeah. You guys don't know about clip on Transformer concept. <laughs> Bro, they don't know, fam. Google that yeah, shit. Yeah, well, I'm saying, I, but I, I, okay, I, because my cousin had a GBA and I had the SP, like me and my brother had the SP. SP was a definite improvement. The, the SP backlight, was, that backlight was, a that backlight was a massive game changer. Mm -hmm. 
I dare say the form factor, like the folding screen, like the clamshell design. I think, I think it was, was better. I think it was better for screen protection because we all know, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. we all know when it got Mush. cracked and you had that little Bro. ink bleed. Bro, I'm not gonna lie though. Like, like, aside from like you dropping the screen like on something pinpoint, mm. when you just dropped it generally, like just using oh, your shit was solid. That yeah, shit was solid. Was solid. Bro, they, they, look, Nintendo exactly. with handhelds knew what they were doing in terms of durability. I mean, like, yeah. Between the two, so between the two, but that uh, that advanced era, for me, great games. Just so many games from Metabots, Digimon, Pokemon. Metabots. Yeah, bro, that Metabots game, even though it wasn't the greatest, oh, it I slapped feel... for me, bro. No. I enjoyed it. I Metabots! Enjoyed it. <laughs> Do you know what, though? I feel Your like... Power. You know... <laughs> Ah. Iki Terrier. Yeah. I feel first of all, Metabots fucking banging. If if people haven't watched Metabots, you should have watched that. Get off our podcast and go watch that. But I just think that the GB. I don't know. Okay, maybe I'm 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 not going to be in the majority for this one. I feel like the GBA was a dip in quality in terms of generations. I feel that the Game Boy Color mm-hmm. just offered better shit. Then you went to GBA no, and like, no, no, no. I, no, no, no. wait, 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 hold up, hold up. I feel, I feel that GBA had a few good games, but majority was a lot of wank, especially stuff like movie titans. No. And then by the time you then got to the DS, Mo- it what? shot movie right back titans. Yeah, yeah, like you, okay, remember back in the day, how they always used to have a movie video game for sure. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, movie oh, yeah, 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 that's come mm-hmm. out. And even even some of the movie games like Aragon and stuff like that. The only game, movie title that slapped, and this was on PlayStation 2, was the fucking Lord of the Rings games. I can tell you. No, 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 wait, no, no. I'll give you another one. I'll give you another one. I'll give you another Spider-Man one. Too. No, no, no. I wasn't even going to figure it, but I'll give you another one. Oh, okay. Um, the Matrix. What was it? Path of Neo? Oh! But Enter the Matrix, Matrix. Enter, Enter the Matrix. Enter the Matrix. Matrix. Enter. But to be honest... Bro, dude, even to be honest, 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 that's that's a that's PlayStation Two. That PlayStation Two. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? The, what we're saying is PS2 had the best. A, a, any, any other game when they'd release game like movie titles, they they generally didn't do. Yeah, I was gonna say Shark Tale was a pretty good time. For I never played that. Shark Tale on Xbox was cold. Actually, man. tell a lie. The Simba game on Game Boy Color, the Lion King game, Game Boy Color. But can you behave yourself and say Sega, bro? Sega, it was way better on Sega, bro. Sega Mega Drive, Lion King on Sega Mega Drive. Oh, and they did Aladdin as well, but that was yeah. Like, yeah, yeah Aladdin, yeah, yeah. basically, the Aladdin game was basically like Castlevania, but yeah, well, the Aladdin skins. That's it. That's yeah, it. What? Yeah. what? No, no. The Game Boy Color one, yes. Well, bro, I'm not talking about Game Boy Color, bro. That's Who what I was talking about. Shit, I'm talking about like Sega fam, because I was, I mean, I was a Sega guy, isn't it? Like so, bro, Sega Saturn over here. I love that. Dude. Sega Saturn. Sega Saturn was slapped on, bro, because huh? that was the competition for PlayStation One, but it got buried because they yeah. had some games on there. Because Sega Saturn wasn't good. I know, but I enjoyed yeah, that it. shit. Was you, you, what was the what was the I best did. game that you had on the second Saturn? It was like what? Virtual out, Fire. Out. Yeah, yeah, like Virtual nah, Fire. You guys right? don't know that you don't know or, the techers. If I bring out some Sega Genesis games, these guys are, these have been lost to the wind. And I think if they could emulate them, they'd be great. There was a game called Three Dirty Dwarfs. You won't know it, but check out the game. That sounds uh, a bit sus, bro. Yeah, no, that sounds a bit sus. I'm not even check thinking about sus. I just think it doesn't sound like a good game. It, it sounds a like game. a. It sounds like a flash game, bro. I can't no, no, that. it is a flash game. 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 It is a banging game. R.I.P. to Flash, by the way. Yes, yeah. yes, R.I.P. Mm. It did it. Unreal Tournament. I used to play on that. <laughs> did you not play the Flash version of Unreal Tournament? No, no, slapped, no, slapped, no, slapped online. Happy Wheel, bro. But, but, just, just, just so we can round up. Yeah. Because we, we're probably over we, time. We are, we are, so. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> over time. Um, I think we can all agree. PS2. Roster PS2. games. Then what was the... Uh, uh, Roster uh, games. Xbox. 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 Series X. Uh, series X. Series X. Or uh, the series. The yeah. series. Yeah, Xbox series. series. Okay. Handheld. We said Handheld. We said... No, no, Steam, Deck. Steam Deck. If we're counting that. If, if we're counting... But if... it's because it's so recent and it's changing the landscape... We'll take it back. I'll put it as a joint one. So probably. minus, so if we minus Steam Deck out of it, yeah. we're saying GBA, it GBA I, I, or GBSP. I, I, I think because they're still the same line, it's just a more. I feel like the DS was better. Than all both right, of so it. we'll just say we'll just say Game Boy. I feel like I, feel like I like mean, you can all, we can all differ. We don't we don't have to. We've agreed unanimously that PS2 had the best roster. But what's yours for uh, handhelds then? Handheld, I would put DS. Like DS. I, I would, I would put DS. If, if okay, if we're talking about the the. The handheld in terms of just like quality of what it is, I think PS Vita. The PS Vita is my favorite. Mm-hmm. But if we're talking just including like library, what it did for the genre at the time, etc., etc., DS. Okay. Light. Yeah, I'd DS probably light. say Game Boy Color. 
for me. I would say Game Boy Advance if it had the SP backlight, but still Game Boy Advance just because of the roster game, I really enjoyed it. Then it's a joint with me with the PSP slash Vita. Just because the PSP, what it did with the multimedia center, I it was it was innovative for a handheld. Mm. And I don't think any other handheld has done that to this day, actually. No one else has done that. Nintendo never bothered really with it. No. They don't need to. The thing is, they don't need to. They don't need to. Do. No, they don't. But, so, but I'm just saying, as, as, as something that you could just get and do so much with if you didn't have... They, they sort of made up for their lack of library with the other things you could do with the... Wait, actually, I think there is there is a competitor. I can't remember what it's called now. Well, that shows they ain't a great competitor, is it? <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. There was... <laughs> though there was one that was supposed to. I think it was... Oh, I'm trying to think off the top of my head. Not, not, NVIDIA, not the uh, NVIDIA's game. No, but that was an online streaming service. It was, oh, was it? I, yeah, I think it might have been about. about. Oh, speaking Stadia. of online service. About Stadia. Wait, you mean... The, Huh? You mean Stadia, like yeah. Google Stadia? Oh yeah, yeah, the Stadia, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was yeah, a handheld. That, that was a handheld. That was, was, like, no, it was, it was an online streaming service, like. Uh, online game. Yeah, it was. A, it was a. You got like okay, a control okay. pad for it, but yeah. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. No one that's like, it, though, yeah. But that was the one I was thinking. Yeah, of. Yeah, yeah, no, no, nobody gives a fuck about Stadia. Um, <laughs> no, fuck shit. Stadia. Yeah, no, it was absolute dog shit. And uh, <laughs> do you mind remember the Ouya as well? Who? Ouya. Wasn't that the? Who? Nah, nah, nah. Ouya was, it was meant to be like a home console, but for like the Android game market. Yeah, mm-hmm. I briefly, because it's a game with an O, right? O-U-Y-A. O-U-Y-A. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was weird. I remember they were putting a hard market in and then that shit just went to it the flopped. dust. Like they, they had a very successful Kickstarter campaign yeah, and yeah, then yeah. it just flopped when it came out. It was terrible. So, right. yeah, no, nah, that, that's peak for them. Last question we'll ask. I know this is overrunning, but fuck it. It's my podcast. I can do what I want. Um, <laughs> so, what would you guys say is just your favorite games console of all time? Like, handheld games console. What would you say is, like, your favorite of Handheld all time? or no, console console? Like, just anything. Like, of any gaming whatever, your favorite of PlayStation all time. PlayStation 2. Just because... Yeah. At the moment, even with the Steam Deck, I bought loads of games from Steam. The minute, I already knew about emulation, but I was just like, I didn't want to go through the process of it. The minute I got into it, all I found myself doing is playing PlayStation 2 games. I've been rolling shit in Katamari, I've been playing Dark Cloud, I've been fucking up Snoop Dogg. I love Snoop, Dogg, <laughs> I love Snoop D-O-double-G, big fan. I've been fucking it all up, yeah. Buster, I've been playing Def Jam Fight, the NY, I've been playing Onomusha. I've just been banging those games out and I've downloaded other stuff for like DS. Mm like the Mega Man series, all of this stuff, but I cannot... I'm playing Final Fantasy X. Mm. I cannot... I can't escape it as a nostalgia, but also the level of what the games were doing in terms of story, innovativeness, just creativity. I love PlayStation 2 and its mm. games. I just think it's great. That's fair. That's fair. What about you? PlayStation 2? Yeah. PlayStation 2. See, I kind of want to say PlayStation 2, but I'm PlayStation. also... And look at these fucking... Fucking... Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, so like, like... 360, man. No, no. Yeah, I'm, yeah. No, I'm inclined to say PS4. Only because I sunk so much time into playing the PS4. Um, and, and this is like... This is like... I'm able to remove nostalgia from it and still be able to appreciate just how much I fucking loved my PS4. But PS4 so the, tank is still fairly recent, though. Yeah, but that doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, yeah still be mine. And like, I, I would mean, put I my PS5 too. over it if, if not for the fact that there's some things on the PS5 that I feel like are held back at the yeah, moment yeah. in terms of like PS5 exclusives and stuff like that. Yeah, they don't have but, enough games as well. Yeah, so. exactly. But the PS4, bro, I, I mean, we gamed a lot on PS4. PS as well together. I mean, before I got rid of it, but mm. then I didn't feel so heartbroken by the loss of it. But that PlayStation 2, when I gave it to my cousins, I was looking for it back again. <laughs> and it's that, but I get what you're saying, because like before Beth Seda got bought out, stuff like Fallout 4, a lot of like decent like double A titles, I put in time with it. Not to talk about the online playability, which is mm. a factor that PS2 never really got into until much much later. But at that time, it was it wasn't yeah, it, it wasn't, wasn't it wasn't it wasn't quite there. But yeah, man, Xbox I, had that. I can list more games. That's why I always go for me. I can list. I even thought of some as we were talking. I went, I got distracted. I was thinking, Mortal Kombat, Shaolin Monks. Does no one remember that game? I never played it. Oh my, I'm, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. I can, I'm, when I bring the Steam Deck, I, next time I bring it, play this game. This was a spin off of the Mortal Kombat traditional fighting. Yeah. They made an open world thing where you could play co op and be busting demons' so, so heads. It was like Tekken Force, basically. 
but <coughs> ten times better. Mm, mm. Blue te blue tech and force right, out that, of the Okay, water. ladies and gentlemen, uh, we're now making a Twitch. The <laughs> yeah, we are. Free, we're making yeah, now we're making yeah, a Twitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Forbidden Juice. So, <laughs> so, so Twitch. Yeah, uh, Forbidden. So you know, <laughs> Twitch.tv forward slash the Forbidden Juice. Yeah, uh, uh, the Forbidden Juice gaming. And <laughs> we're running exclusively Steam Deck games. Yeah, yeah, yeah and I'll be your you're leading resident that. on everything Steam Deck. Channel, yeah, you'll be, you'll channel be coming that. soon. And uh, yeah, fans, if you want to pick the game, the biggest donation gets to pick the game. Fam, do you know what would be a sick idea? I can't even lie. If we did like a gaming channel, right? But like each person specializes in like a certain console or something like that. Oh, bro, don't, don't, don't chat to me. I've already got, I've already, already got <laughs> <laughs> I'm already on the team. As soon as I mention Twitch, it's the gizzard. Bro, I've already got a Twitch channel. I've actually got yeah, so, yeah, I've so been I. streaming Overwatch. I'm trying to like, it? yeah. Wait, what? I've been talking, bro. Uh, Overwatch 2, bro. I've been climbing the ranks. I'm bro, almost at platinum. But I've got played some terrible games. It's just. I'm not going to lie. You, got, you need to work hard for uh, Twitch views. Yeah, you do, but I yeah. don't mind. I just put it on, and yeah. I got no mic, no nothing, and I got this one person following me, and I don't know who it is. Bro, that's There's one mad. person that watches the whole thing. I've been on there for an hour. Like, who the fuck is this? That's and mad. I literally contacted my buddy. I was like, "Is this you?" He's like, "No." And I was like, "Who? <laughs> who is it?" Wait, are you sure it's not like yourself? Like, cause no, 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 because no, 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 no. I'm playing the game. As, so you, as, you, you, as, a, as a streamer, you don't, you don't count. As you don't count towards the yeah, count. Yeah, so you've got one person that just is watching you. Just tunes in and watches. That's crazy. Because the thing is, you're not. Talking fam, like no one can, they can't hear you, they can't see you, no nothing. They just see me fly around throwing balls everywhere. That's Wait, wild. They're, 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 they're just watching the game? Yeah, they're watching the game. That's wild. Or they've just got it on and they've left it on, but I whatever, can't it says it's a like view. That. I can't stream like that. <laughs> and it stays there, because you know if someone drops out, it, yeah, just, it, just, leaves. Yeah, yeah. it just stays there That's until I wild. finish the stream. And I'm like, Are you sure it's not like a moderator, make sure you're not doing anything illegal or something, bro. <laughs> like, that could be it, it could count on a stream, but yeah. they, they are watching all the way through. That's wild. Fam, because because the thing is, I've been streaming and like I don't get that. <laughs> like I don't have the one, but like if there's no one there, there is no one there. <laughs> like I will see zero. So, oh, fam, you got one royal. <laughs> <laughs> I've got one more than you, bitch. They haven't, they haven't sent me anything yet, so yeah, no just, death threats or no gifts. Yeah, no, no, no Twitch affiliate just yet. Well, I mean, I mean, I mean, like no news is good news, right? I, uh, yeah, somewhat, 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 somewhat. But yeah, but look, guys. You know, I mean, comment down below. Let us know what your thoughts are about the discussion that we've had about you know what your what you think is like the best game library, what you think is the best console out of the box, what you think is the best handheld, what just you know what I mean all the other stuff that we've talked about. But until then, follow us on all our different social media. Um, you know, we got Twitter, and we got Instagram, uh, so go follow us on that, and obviously the YouTube channel, of course. Uh, but yeah, we will catch you guys in the future. But until then, we out. So much love. Take care. Deuces. It's been real. It's been love. Yada yada. Let's stop recording now. I'm bored.